Well, there's a possible explanation tonight for the recent spike in COVID-19 cases, and it comes from the modeling done by local researchers that was done at the request of local leaders who wanted a way to track the coronavirus. Our Seth Kovar has a look now at the latest findings. The Texas A&M Corpus Christi researchers present their updated models every Friday here at City Council Chambers. But with the increased number of cases this week, there was certainly added interest in the room. I think people really need to pay attention right now. To the increasing number of cases of COVID-19 in the coastal bend. While not quite at the rate during outbreaks like the one at STX Beef, TAM UCC modeling data isn't pretty. There's been a consistent uptick in the accumulation of new cases. And so that's what we're concerned with. It's not as steep as it was uh, for those outbreaks uh, before, but you know, that doesn't mean that this is less dangerous in, in any way. Dangerous, but perhaps explainable. Researcher Christopher Bird gave today's report partially on the increasing number of cases. He says it could be a combination of what he called a Memorial Day bump, lots of people spending time together over the holiday weekend, and the relaxation of the interventions we once had in place. Less people are staying at home, more people are going to restaurants and going to the malls. Um, maybe there's a little bit of relaxation on wearing of masks. We're, we're, we're not sure, we don't have information on that. But something's happening that seems to be kicking the transmission rate up. To get that rate to go down, as Texas reopens more and more, local health leaders say it's important that you do your part, like socially distancing and wearing masks. The public has to remember that it's not just about the reopening. You you still have to follow the, the, the right prevention tools. And city leaders hope that state leaders are paying attention to stories like these. We can see it's, that's why we have you all here, because we need to really track it and communicate to policymakers about what's happening locally. And as I mentioned, the updated models are a weekly thing here at City Council Chambers. And with more businesses opening up, we'll be anxious to see what next Friday holds. Reporting in Corpus Christi, Seth Kovar, Chris 6 News.